Assignment 13. Grammar. Past perfect tense and past perfect continuous. Assalamu alaikum dear students. How are you doing? I'm sure you're having a good time with your family and your friends and also completing your home tasks too. Today we are going to do grammar and in grammar first we will do past perfect tense and then we will do past perfect continuous tense. This video is divided into two parts so do watch each part in order to understand uh, what we are trying to teach you. Okay. So let's start. Do you, do you know what uh, does... Alright. There are different uses for past tense, past perfect tense, right? So, so when can we use the first thing is to show that an action happened before something else in the past. That action happened before another action, right? So we use past perfect tense to indicate an action that happened before another action. If you look at this example, she stayed up all night because she had received bad news, right? Or news. So had received bad news. So first she received the bad news and then she stayed up all night. So it indicates that before this action, she stayed up all night another action took place which is she had received a bad news right so had received here is our past perfect tense let's move toward our next use all right second use to show that an action happened before a specific time in the past specific time in the past right so the action it took place before a specific time in the past here she had established her country before 2008 right all right the second use is to show that an action happened before a specific time in the past right so that action took place before a specific time for example she had established her company before 2008 so this is the time we're talking about specific time so she has done that action before this particular time so we are using had for that okay our next use is it includes reported speech when we are talking in a reported speech or uh, we change from uh, direct speech to reported speech we use past perfect tense if it is present perfect okay the teacher asked if we had studied for exams right another example is the usher asked if we had purchased our tickets right so just in reported speech we use had to indicate past perfect tense all right another use is to show dissatisfaction with past when you're not really satisfied with the past for example we wish we had purchased the winning ticket i wish i had told the truth right when you are regretting you are dissatisfied or you're not really actually satisfied with your past then you use had to indicate that Okay. let's move towards the sentence structure of past perfect tense all right okay so this is the structure for affirmative we have subject then had and then past participle you can say third form of verb as well fine so subject plus had plus past past participle then in negative we have subject plus hadn't with had we use not it's negative form so we'd say hadn't then we have a past participle all right for questions we put the had before the subject so had plus subject plus part participle like third form of word so these are the structures how to make a past perfect tense i'm sure you have understood past perfect tense now we will do our exercises so we have exercise e here you have to underline the action that happened first. I'm doing the first one for you. By the time I woke up, my brother had gone to school. So, which happened? 
so which action happened first waking up or the brother going to the school by the time i woke up so he woke up after my brother had gone to school so had gone to school is the action that happened first now we move towards our next exercise all right exercise f in this exercise you have to make a chart like the one given in your assignment then talk about it with your partner you have to use past perfect tense in it right using past perfect tense you have to make a chart like the one given in your assignment and then you have to talk about it with your partner or friend or family member now next exercise all right this is exercise b circle the correct answer i'm going to do the first one for you right the options are given you have to circle the correct tense basically right so they had eaten in a small restaurant you have two options is it present perfect or it's past perfect right so what do you think it has a had in it right and third form right so it is basically a past perfect Exercise C. In this exercise, you have to make the sentences negative, right? So I'm doing the first one for you. We had arranged our vacation through a travel agent or travel guide. Fine. So we want to make it negative. We hadn't arranged our vacation. short form we had okay and then when we were making it negative we just wrote we hadn't so you have to do the rest of the exercise in the same way all right our next exercise is exercise d in this exercise write questions in the past perfect to match the answers this is the answer my parents had decided to go to asia right so i'm going to write the question for it fine where had parents decided to go don't forget to put a question okay so the answer was my parents had decided to go to asia right so we made a question using past perfect tense where had your parents decided to Go. So you have to make questions like this. Now exercise E. In this exercise, you have to circle the correct verb, right? First one, the weather had been or has been perfect, right? So you have to do it. Which one do you think is correct? Hmm? The weather had been perfect or has been perfect. So we are going to take what weather had been. Perfect. Next exercise. All right. Exercise F. Read Tanya's story and answer the questions. First question is: Had Tanya's family decided to go on vacation somewhere cold or somewhere warm? Right. So when you read it, you are going to know the answer is: They had decided. Past perfect in a past perfect sentence, 
we can have a simple past and also a past perfect so one is going to be simple past and the other is going to be past perfect look at the example when i reached there my friends had already gone reached here indicates your simple past okay reached second form of verb right my friends had already gone this is your past perfect tense right so the one either the beginning one or the last one one of them is going to be a simple past tense and the other is going to be the past perfect tense i have one more example for you had anyone been in the house before you arrived arrived here is your simple past and had anyone been is your past perfect tense okay now we move towards our exercises all right exercise c complete the sentences using past perfect of the words given in the bracket so the word is given in the bracket so we have to make the past perfect okay so what we have to do we have to use had and the third form of the past participle of the word for okay the geezer blank many centuries ago so the geezer had formed many centuries ago so you're going to do the exercise in the same way let's move to the next exercise all right in exercise d you have to match the questions with the answers you can write the letters okay so number one is had the girl learned about volcanoes so it is going to match the c part which is yes she had she had learned in her geography class all right so your exercise e is that you have to write a question for each answer right so the first answer is no i had never seen a volcanic eruption before right so i'm going to write the question for you had you ever seen a volcanic eruption exercise is exercise F so you have to complete the sentences in your own words use the past perfect tense keep in your mind we have to use past perfect tense so first one is by the time I got home so you can write anything so I'm writing they had already past perfect tense uh, this is the end of part 1 inshallah i will see you soon in part 2 take care allah hafiz